carry on with some of our show business friends here. Mr. Birnbaum, uh, this kid is doing well in the ragtime world, and uh, he wants to drop down to what? You going to give me some presents? Sure, I've got some presents. You know, I'm playing a lot of places in, of course, the village, but I've got some charming things. You know, we just had Lou Albano on. Of course, he's always in the paper, as you are lately, in Daily News. There's Lou. Oh, he's our clipping service. There's Captain Lou uh, in the press clippings. And this man was on our show recently, yeah. and we should have mentioned... Shorty uh, Jackson. He passed away. He, was, uh, he made his last appearance here. He was right. great. He was 90 years old on this show. And on the cover of this magazine is... Uh, what's this fellow's name again? I can't remember. Frank it's the only uh, one I couldn't uh, figure uh, out. Joe Frank. Into and the intermission, my friends, with a touch of ragtime kid uh, Mark Birnbaum and a glimpse of... Well, we'll be playing you uh, a little bit of Mark Birnbaum. I'll be at the Angry Squire. No, I mean the music, the music. Oh, sorry. Uh, Jelly Roll Morton would be 100 years old. King Porter Stump. You know, you don't look that old. A little bit no, of... No, <laughs> I'm a little bit dressed of King up pretty well Porter for the occasion. Stump, as done by Mr. Ragtime, a sample.